NZISM is organized into eight security domains, each of which contains a set of security requirements. These domains are 1. Security Governance This domain establishes the framework for information security management within an organization. It includes requirements for senior management involvement, risk management, and security policies. 2. Personnel Security This domain focuses on the vetting, selection, and management of personnel with access to sensitive information or systems. It includes requirements for personnel security clearances, background checks, and security training. 3. Physical Security This domain covers the requirements for protecting physical assets, such as buildings, equipment, and storage media. It includes requirements for access controls, environmental controls, and physical security monitoring. 4. Information System Security This domain focuses on securing information and communications systems. It includes requirements for system design and configuration, access control, network security, and software development, encryption, and security monitoring. 5. Communications Security This domain focuses on the protection of information transmitted across communication networks. It includes requirements for encryption, key management, and secure communication protocols. 6. Information Security Incident Management This domain involves the identification, management, and resolution of security incidents. It includes requirements for incident reporting, incident response planning, and incident handling. 7. Business Continuity Management This domain focuses on ensuring the continuity of critical business processes and services in the event of a disruption or disaster. It includes requirements for business impact analysis, continuity planning, and testing. 8. Compliance This domain involves the adherence to legal and regulatory requirements, as well as industry best practices. It includes requirements for security audits, risk assessments, and reporting in order to protect government information and assets. Successful completion of the C&A process requires adherence to the requirements in each of these security domains. By ensuring that all applicable requirements are identified and addressed, a project team can demonstrate that their system is designed and implemented in a secure manner, and meets the necessary security standards. The security domains provide a framework for ensuring that all relevant security aspects are considered and addressed, helping to ensure that the system is secure and protected from potential threats. We cover the domains in detail through this series.